絶対的天地は一つその理も一つであります私たちがその天地の理を実行するなら世の人々は全てこれに合わせてくるはずです。愛義道というのは読んで字のごとく木にガスルの道、天地の木にガスルの道であります。ただ勝ち負けを論ずるのではなく自分自身の一挙手一投足も天地の方にかなうように訓練するのが愛義道の修行であります。ただいまからご覧に入れます愛義道の技は私が49歳の時に移したものです。普通う体だけを死にして生活している人は30ぐらい過ぎるとどんどん体力が衰えてきますしかし合気道は天地から与えられた心と体を必ず統一使う技ですでありますから年取ってからできな,いできなくなるということは絶対ありませんむしろ年取れば取るほど心身統一が深くなってまいりますとといいううここはいくつになっても秋戸の技はでできるということであります。私は当年とって75歳ですけどまだまだ信用中ですこれからさらにさらに深く研究したいと思います世の年配の方々も年取ってダメになったなんて思わないでますます置いてますます盛んなりという息を盛んにして一つ生活していただきたいと思います手首運動 This exercise promotes relaxation. Fune Kogi Undo. The name derives from the similarity of the movements to boat rowing. If when executing this exercise, you keep your spirit concentrated in the single spot in the lower abdomen, though your opponent pushes you from the back or the front, he will be unable to budge you. Ikkyo undo. Once again, throughout the exercise, It is vital to keep the spirit concentrated in the single spot in the lower abdomen. This is true of all Aikido exercises. Without this concentration, your exercises will be incorrect. Whether the movements are forward and backward only, as in the Zengo Undo, or in eight directions, as in the Hapo Undo, you must always face in the direction in which you are moving. This exercise employs the fundamentals of leading the strength of an opponent who is advancing toward you. Tekubi Kosa Undo. 
Though it seems simple, this exercise helps develop a posture from which your opponent cannot move you, either upward or to the rear. It is most important, however, to relax your arms completely, because if you tense them, your opponent will be able to move you as he wishes. Sayu Undo. After raising your arms to the side, you crouch slightly. The crouch movement is used in throwing an opponent. Udefuri Undo. The most widely used move in Aikido. This exercise serves to pull your opponent into a circular movement created by your body. The center of the circle, your body itself, is stable. Consequently, the swing of your arms is powerful. Ushiro Dori Undo. This exercise is used to throw forward an opponent who attacks from behind. When your partner has seized both your wrists from behind using this movement, it is possible to throw him forth over your head. Ushiro Tekubi Tori Undo. This move is used to step the side of and to throw an opponent who is gripping your wrist from behind. The unbendable arm. This is a fine example of the way the spirit can control the body. First, tense your arm and have your opponent try to bend it. He can do so easily. Next, relax your arm, but concentrate on sending your strength a thousand miles forward. As long as you maintain this mental attitude, he will be unable to bend your arm. Anyone can do this. Preventing an opponent from lifting you. Stand with your body tense. Your opponent can lift you with no trouble. If, however, you relax and concentrate your ki in the single spot in the lower abdomen, even a man stronger and heavier than you are cannot raise you from the ground. If your ki is pouring forward powerfully, you have this much strength in your little finger. Do not try this often. The slightest carelessness can lead to a broken bone. A calm spirit in the direction of the flow of ki can make a great difference in a person's power. Practice exercises for two people. Do not force your partner. Instead, you should both cooperate and lead each other as you maintain strong outpourings of ki. The person whose ki stops for even a second will be thrown. If you keep your spirit concentrated in the single spot in the lower abdomen, you will not be dizzy when you stand. Sayu Undo with a partner. When an opponent attacks with an ikkyo, lead him first, then throw him with this move. Do not let your key stop flowing or your opponent will throw you. 